Well, hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to another Grizzly Bear Sims course play tutorial. So, over the last couple of uh, tutorials, we've talked about how to set up course play routes to uh, plow, how to set up a course play route to seed, and we've also uh, demonstrated how to set up course play routes for both spreading. Um, granular fertilizer as well as spraying fertilizer or spraying anything else that um, you might uh, want to spray and of course right now fertilizer is our only option until maybe soil mod comes along but in any event um, there's going to come a time where things are going to maybe get a little um, out of control with your um, with your course play routes and there's a easy way a very easy way to organize things into folders where you can basically create a folder a subfolder if you will uh, call it you know field 31 or field 32 and you can put all of your course play routes for that field into those folders so it keeps everything a little bit clean and organized for you because quite honestly you don't need to see uh, course play routes for field 26 when you're going to be working in field number 32 or 33 or whatever. So how is that done? So as you can tell, we've got quite a few different courses uh, that we've set up for field number 33 to do different things with, and a lot of these we've we've actually discussed here in the tutorial. So let's create a subfolder for field 33. So the way that we're going to do that is we click on this icon right over here, which is create new folder. And by the way, we're in the manage courses uh, section so it's the third icon from the left manage courses we're going to click on this and we're going to name this field 33 you can name it whatever you want to or f33 uh, whatever you want to do whatever whatever naming convention you want to use and then what we want to do so that subfolder has been created it's not or it's not uh, doesn't have anything in it so that's why it's gray so we're going to go to our first course which is our fertilization course we're going to click on the third icon from the left which is the folder with the little arrow on it we're going to click that guy and then we're going to come down here and we're going to click on field 33 and now we have the one uh, course in there so we'll just rinse and repeat until we get all of these done so field 33 plow field 33 just like that bada bing bada boom it's pretty simple to do but this is going to clean everything up for you because again you don't need to see these courses for fields that you aren't actively working it's just going to become uh, a little bit of a, of a confusion point for you because this list as you go along if you use course play uh, for much of your um, um, AI type control work you're going to have quite a few different um, different uh, courses between seeding all the fields fertilizing the fields plowing the fields all of your your um, um, uh, you know transporting grain from your farm silo to a cell point etc all that is going to to fall into this list and so this is just a very easy way of doing that so let's uh, let's go ahead and set up one for field 28 again just so you can see so again we want to click on our create new folder we're going to name it field 28 we're going to hit enter and we'll have a folder and these will obviously if you name them uh, accordingly they will fall into alphabetical order and numerical order so that's good so field 28 so we want to come down here to our field 28 uh, our fertilize click that click that and then we're back and then field 28 plow click that and then click that and then I think there was one more field 28 seed click that and then come back and click field 28 and that's all we need to do it's pretty simple and I hope it makes sense to you and I hope that if it's becoming a little bit confusing with all of your course play lists that you'll take advantage of these and then of course if we were actually going to use this if we had a plow or something attached to our tractor and we were on field 32 um, as an example we would just drop this down click on field 32 plow uh, add it to our our course and then you know come over here and then click start you know start course at first waypoint position your tractor etc and it would 
uh, off he would go. So hopefully this tutorial has helped you. It's a short one. Uh, thank you all so much for watching, and please tune back in again very, very soon for another course play tutorial here on the Grizzly Bear Sims YouTube channel. Thank you. Bye-bye.